So I've been thinking about strength, man. Strength, might, the power to fight. Is it money, authority, a cool job, a ton of likes? <laughs> okay, okay. Let's keep it simple. I want to be strong. Can you believe it? We got self-driving cars. The time's coming. We'll be taking rockets to Mars. And yet you still got folks out there using their fists and bodies to seek strength. Yeah, I hear you, man. We're all a bunch of fools. But, you know, if you want to know about strength, you just got to get to it. We fighting fools are all getting to it on the streets. Want to know what strength is? Once you start looking for it, <coughs> nothing else catches your eye. Fighting may not be the answer, but just maybe it'll show us. You my new recruit? Kids, take a breather! Welcome. This is Buckler Security Services. I'm Luke, the coach around here. You're here for basic training, right? Okay, let's get you measured up. Body size and your reach are all factors in a fight. How so it check hang? everything carefully. Excuse me, Luke. How's it hanging, everybody? This is your boy Lobo, and welcome to World Tour Mode for Street Fighter VI. Now, full disclosure, I will be honest with you. I played a bit of World Tour Mode um, all the way up to this one mission where I have to go to the United Kingdom, but I have not played through the United Kingdom. I was just grinding in the thing. But I felt like while I was recording my videos, um that there wasn't enough impact for it so i decided to delete my recordings uh, it's a very foolish thing i know but um i wanted to make this a, a little bit better for most part um so with that being said we're gonna go ahead and create a character the name that you see before you is a character that is not specifically for like me lobo it's more or less a character I created. You can save all of your coolness and data for. Shut up, Wild. Luke. Shush, Luke. Hush. But, um, this is a character I created, um, back when I was a child. It, it, it was funny. You, when, you guys will see the picture when I, when I edit this video. But it, this character I created based off what I saw from sh what I loved about Street Fighter, and he looked like a bootleg ass Dragon Ball Z character because I was like the only thing I knew how to could potentially draw when I was really really young so ladies and gentlemen say hello to good old Ron Howard he's not exactly the character that's closest to the um picture but he's about as close to it as I can get with the little highlights here and there um, a lot more highlights in the in the front of the bangs, but that's that's okay. Um, when you see the, the two pictures right beside each other, like the the first picture I will show is based off his like o o was his old look, and then like back in 2014, I edited the picture. I I revamped all my old scenes back back then in 2014, and then the the picture that you'll see next is the final version of how I how I edited him, how I um made up my style of them so um yeah we're gonna go ahead and bring this guy to the scene of street fighter oh man i'm kind of excited though 
Speaking of fucking Luke's goofy ass grin in the intro. <laughs> yeah, gotta say, you're photogenic. Yeah. Oh, righty. Well, that should about wrap up your enrollment. Okay. Again, you can call me Luke. We're just coach. Hey. Okay, then. Hope you're ready to begin. Here we go. We're gonna play through the whole First, tutorial the soon. We can skip. We can skip it if we want, but we can. Um, let's go ahead and just go through the whole this whole story. Let's have you start by making it over to where I am. Feel free to walk or run, whatever gets you here. <laughs> All right. So obviously you got your whole walking. What? Too easy? Hey, it was still an important first step. Yes. Journey of a thousand miles. Anyway, moving right along. I am actually digging Luke's like um new design. His old design, um I didn't really much like my like it, but like this new one looks way cooler. I placed some panels on the floor. You see them? Yeah. I want you to pass through every last one and then make your way back to me. Sound good? Yeah. So um oh, that's just another thing. So the thing about this is it's cool for this world tour because um with this camera you can use R1 on like a con on an arcade stick to to use the camera which is pretty right cool. Looks like you've got the hang of things. Yes, I do. Let's get right to it then. Show me how you are with your fists. Okay. So we get to use the modern controllers. So we'll go ahead and play through the tutorial and all that. And we gotta just approach Luke. Complete. There we That's go. it. It sucks that they didn't give you like pre-recorded voice lines for each of the voices, but I guess that'd probably be too much work. But this game is gonna sell pretty good. Like I already know this Complete. game sells pretty damn good. Good. The fact that you create your character, go through world tour mode. It's good for a casual level. Like, um. It's very good for a casual level. Complete. That they, good. this is like specifically incorporated for casual people, and that's what they were focusing on during, um, I guess during the making of Street Fighter V. I guess Street Fighter V was just, it, it got good towards the last few seasons. Um, I never played through all of them. I never played through the last season, but I, I wish I had, because I would love to have played as, um, as Akira. Okay. From Rival Schools. Speaking of like rival schools, I hope they can bring like Batsu or some other rival schools character into um, Street Fighter 6 as DLC. That'd be freaking sick. And... Bang! Nice work. Nice work. Try to throw Luke. So it starts off with modern controllers first, which is not bad. Nice work. Um, then it goes straight. It moves on to uh, you can choose right. glasses. That about covers the basics. Kind of boring, right? Yeah. <laughs> I knew it. That's how the basics are. It actually looks a lot cleaner Simple than the last two edits that I made them. <laughs> remember, even the biggest rockets need a stable launching pad for takeoff, or else they're just gonna crash and burn. You get me? Coach, how is any of that gonna help him handle this? make him a DLC character if he's just relative to the Then again, he's, he is just, um... He is just, uh... Um, a new clone. Gonna be the type to jump before you think. But coach, 
That was the kind of situation I want to learn to deal with. You're not here to punch bags either, right? <sighs> ah, right. This is Bosch. He signed up for the same regiment you are. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah this Bosch. Look, both of you are my trainees, and you joined at the same time. So play nice, okay? Coach, we both came here looking for strength. Here we go. Mm -hmm. If both of us are trying to find <laughs> that strength, sooner or later, one of us is going to get there first. What happens to the other person then? We all know that nobody's going to be friends after that, so why bother pretending now? Ah, oh, Bosh, my man. That's a really tough question. You gotta know what strength means to you before you go looking for it. Yep. You go looking for the wrong things, and you really might end up in that situation someday. But you know what? You can cross that bridge when you get to it. You two are still my plucky little trainees. I'm like now listen to what your coach says, and put your hearts into your training. Focus on that. Yep. Come on, buddy. All right. Okay, let's get back to business. You wanted something more practical, right? Well, practicality comes in many forms. But if you want to start off on the right foot in this city, this is the best part. Hit the streets. <laughs> oh, that that opened up a bunch of memes. That is just fucking hilarious. I have a general idea of where I want to end this video, so let's see how long this tutorial takes. Before. It, it might be a short, a short first parter, but um, yeah, I, I, that's how I plan. This is how I planned on setting up some of my things. Uh, city once um, dominated by the Mad Gear organization, thanks to the staunch efforts of former Mike Agger. Former mayor Mike Hager, peace and prosperity return to the city. Got, and then you got the Siren Building, which is like a some new organization. But to this day, on the streets, there's one thing that hasn't changed. Oh, magic illusion. The denizens who survived that dark age are still just as tough as they were. So here we go. Eventually, I actually found the, the, the clothes corresponding to my character's OC, to my, like, my, my OC's, like, design. So, along those lines, and what's cool is that you can layer, you can layer those, um, you can layer the clothes that you're using your stats for over, you can layer, you can layer over those clothes, um, a, a lo later along the lines of the story. So, actual hands-on experience on the streets. Beating up the bad guys around here should do the trick. Where the hell is it now? Sorry, did that joke fly over your head? Um, At any rate, I was told this would point us towards our next steps. Go. Oh. oh, hang on a minute. I'm getting a message from the coach. There's an app on your device. Check it out. Did you get anything? Good. So here we go. You can read your messages when you press the touchpad is what it's going to tell you. So let's get started. Let's get you started with some missions. From here on out, I'll be sending you training exercises to the map, to the missions app. Check it out and follow any instructions that pop up there. Uh, and then you got your missions that are over here. So welcome to the streets where you go and what you do is entirely up to you. But if you'd like to get a feel of for how things are usually done here somewhere, there's no quicker way than asking the locals. Look for a person named Alice. She'll show you the ropes. Okie dokie. And then you got your whole thingy that I'm going to try to... I can't even get it out of the way. So there you go. Hmm. Alright, chapter one unlocked. Hmm. Okay, so it's basically a to-do list. The first thing we need to do is talk to that person right over there. Hey. That should be easy. Let's get going. And here we go. 
Moving on. Yeah, so the red marks are your, the red the red crowns are your um main missions and later it'll tell you like the the green Why, the green um crowns are your submissions. So her name is Alice and you two must be a couple of rookies who just want to get strong. Um right on the money. How did you know it was mm, us? Right. Seriously? Come on, it's practically written on your faces. Is it now? Kidding, kidding. You're Luke's students, right? <laughs> he asked me to assist you with your training for a bit. For starters, your little mission to come talk to me was a smashing success. Next up, how about we have ourselves okay. a fight? Don't hold anything back now. I'm a lot stronger than you two. Okay, Doki. Let's go for it. So now we get to um learn about assisted combos, which is um you're basically your your auto combos in modern in the modern controller. So we'll go ahead and um wow, jerk. Dude, I will say that that they went a perfect direction of going back to um the roots of their music which is like hip hop and shit. So I, like they did a they did a good job man with all with all this with all this music that you, you will hear during um world tour. So Okie doke. Looks like you're still getting your street leg street fighting legs. As far as your next mission, how about you go fight someone else? You can challenge someone to a fight with Square and then come talk to me after you beat two opponents. So we're gonna go ahead, take out two guys, and that'll be the end of it. So who do I? I, I guess start off with you. Okay. So using items and oh, well. Okay. That one guy down. Take the lady down. Good games. Good games. Good games. Um, and there you go. And we're done. Later. gain experience which is so cool the the rpg aspect the rpg aspect all right I'm going to talk back to to this ah. person right on that's that taken care of what do we say we report back to alice fancy that got in the field for fighting yet nothing beats trying it for yourself when you're out and about not everyone you run into will go as easy on you as i do so if you're starting to look for a fight with someone, pick your opponent wisely. Anyway, I'll catch you two again sometime. Alrighty then. Now we got a new message from the coach. Sometimes you gotta talk to folks on the streets and ask them for a fight. Think of it like saying hi on the streets, only with lots more punching. And if all that punching works up an appetite, go ahead and grab yourself a bite. There's a food truck nearby. You'd never guess from the look of it, but they do have a killer pizza grab a slice and you'll see i'm not i know i'm like playing on the words that what they're saying but like that's how i'm interpreting it in my brain to get to 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 not read as slow because i i believe i might i might have developed some form of dyslexia or i might have been just dyslexic to begin with so eating food is part of your training too is coach just messing with us although i am pretty hungry might as well do what he says Yes, man. Didn't you know you can't freaking fight in an empty stomach? What's wrong with you, man? Look, look at me, Bosh. Look at me. What is wrong with you, dummy? Welcome. All right. So we gotta eat our fill. So we're gonna go ahead and grab this because why not? It's the cheapest thing we can buy. Thank you. Sure. <laughs> you know, I'd swear up and down that the food back where I'm from is the best in the world. 
but pizza is clearly like cheating or something. How do you compete with cheese this hot and gooey? You don't. Except if it's lasagna. If you make a good lasagna. Or baked ziti. Alright, so he's gonna keep freaking talking to me, which is why I'm gonna stop. Which is why I'm not gonna read, because he, he texts... He texts like that. At like a at a snap of a finger, I mean, like if you read this dude's profile, this man be gaming. So what I tell you, bomb pizza, huh? All pizza is good pizza, but the pepperoni gets my vote any day. If you ever roll, run low on stamina, eating something will get you back on your feet. Um, some food will even have you hitting harder, moving faster in the works. Food can power you up in all kinds of ways, so don't be shy about expanding your palate. Now that you're done filling up, why don't you just why don't you pay a visit to that nearby alleyway? Oh, really? Yeah. All right. So we gotta head to the alleyway next. Man, what is it this time? Sorry, I'm just enjoying the beat, but look. Look at this freaking city, man. Meet the new you. I thought it said New York. And then over there on the sign right up there, you can see like it's referencing the, the Street Fighter 2 games. The World Warrior Champion Edition and Hyper Fighting. Uh, you got Metrosip. Metrosip? And then the Beauty Lab Salon. So this, that Beauty Salon over there is where you can go to, um, to re-edit your characters. You just pay like money for it. The final fight, the finalist fight. Ugh. Jesus, that's so lame. Good God. I didn't really get a chance to look at all this either when I was recording. I want to take a look at it. Hey, and then you see Manning. You got DJ over there. And then you got good old Hugo. I wonder if you'll see any other final fight characters like Hugo in them or if they'll be mentioned. That'd be interesting. Oh, I'm sorry, boss. Were you doing something? I I, I was too busy on um, distracting sightseeing and stuff. Because I didn't do that when I was recording. I wasn't paying attention to my surroundings as much. Which is not something I should be doing. I, I should take in and breathe in all this stuff, you know? Like, it's so cool. And then you got... I think that's the new siren building that they were looking at earlier. Hey, you! go so there will be times where you'll be fighting a lot more opponents the more opponents that gather up around you when they when they start chasing you the more you're gonna have to fight per wave sometimes you'll fight two in a row sometimes you'll even fight three I don't I've not I've only fought enough to like three in a row before so let's see what we got going on here. and I right here if you pause the menu you can um, check the win condition, the battle information, and if you do the condition right, you um, you get you get drop blocks or something, some, something along those lines. Yeah. Look at him wearing the Capcom logo. That is full right here. Hello, you two. We meet again. Let me introduce you to my brothers, Tracy and Ryan. Now, Ryan, that's another that's another name of an OC I made. <laughs> so let me introduce... All right. Hey. So Luke asked us to give you a hand with your training, you know. Get the whole family on board kind of hmm. deal. Surprise. These box disguises sure uh -huh. are something. We're imitating the thugs around here. They hide their faces just like this. They're attacking folks left and right, so be careful out there, got it? Ah. And there will be times when it's not just one opponent, too. As you just clearly saw. So, beware of all these guys. Any ones that wear this, um... That wear disguises on their faces or anything around those lines, um... There will be your enemies. They'll most likely attack you. The thugs will most likely attack you. There's a lot of characters who have 
different colors to their names. I don't know exactly what it means. It could be the, the difficulty settings, but it doesn't look like it, that's the case considering the, the bad guys, the thugs, are going to be with the red. And they'll be prov they're provoked very easily. So, um, oh, so, yeah, sometimes the streets will bring the fight to you. When it's time to bust out, that's when it's time to bust out the self-defense. Trust me, there are some places you do not want to wander in unless you got the chops. Consider this training to help you traverse the streets whenever, wherever. Wherever, whenever. I, I flopped it. <laughs> I don't know why. So, cool. Next lesson. See that sign that for the apparel shop? I want you to do some shopping there. This is, this is, this is like the most driest thing. An apparel shop? I've heard of those. They sell clothing and the like. There, right? I've never been to a place like that before. But if it's in the name of training, I can't refuse. Yep. And they tell you later on that this is actually the, um, thingy my bobber. Do, 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 yeah, Marissa. And then you got Blanca. Get out of here, Blanca. No. I freaking they actually made like Blanca and um Honda the characters that you have to like mash the button to do their their repeated moves like the electric thunder and um oh well by the way we're in the dripping style here over there that you see on the top left um they actually made their uh them a lot more easier and a little bit more fun to play too like i don't know who, i haven't just i haven't played online yet because i was getting through the trials but i think after i do a little bit of um I'm going to do some videos here and there for both the world tour and for the arcade modes for all the character stories. So we'll go ahead and see, check that out. And look at this. Like, you can't put the hat on any way you want it, as you'll see when I buy it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, I got the freaking hat. I can't, like, turn it to the side or turn it to the back. Like, I have to buy it. It's, it's placed on your head in the way that it shows on the picture. Excuse me. This is doesn't exactly go with what I'm wearing, does it? But we match, bro. We match. <laughs> is that supposed to make this less cringe? Is that how people put it around here? <laughs> you misunderstand. Matching is really not the issue here. In fact, it only makes it worse. Ah. All right. Here we go with coach. Shop till you drop doesn't even matter if you're the fashionable type to be honest a little bit of attention to your outfit can make all the difference in a fight and hey doesn't it feel good when you find that outfit that just speaks to you cool let's wrap things up for the day i'm wandering around the city as we speak let's see if you can find me okay hey um, what time is it 5:23. okay I, I gotta keep in mind because i'm i woke up a little later so um this is this video is going to be short when I edit the video later on so coach is on the way and said he wants us to find him So you should be easy to find he stands out as much as I do. Yeah, you can see him in the background right there So let's go ahead and find him um, These videos might be short. I'm gonna try to make them late longer later on uh, I don't I don't I said I know where I was going to leave this at, but I'm not entirely sure now, so we'll What's see. What's up? So, how's the city treating you? Getting some practical experience on the streets? Um, Coach, are we really getting stronger by running around like hold this? Hold up, hold up. Doubting the wisdom of old Luke Sensei, are you? Let's see where you at, then. All right. Don't worry about taking turns, both of you. Let's go. All right, so here we go. Yeah. <laughs> 
Alright, let's see if I get. Oh no! Oh fuck! <laughs> I fucked up! <laughs> oh, I fucked up! I was gonna try to beat him. I failed on both, on th all three accounts. Dang it. <laughs> so, you oh, need to check out the city, see the sights, rack up some wins. And then you come back with the confidence to go toe to toe with your lovable coach. Sure. You guess that practical training paid off in spades. Am I right? <laughs> yes. Good God. If you want to make it in this world, you got to do what you can. Grind like crazy. Not let up. Not for a second. You got the drip. The That's road to the top is long, but you just got to take it one step at a time. Sick trip, unlike me. I'm so casual. <laughs> that first step you both took just now? Yeah. It's something to be proud of. Mm. Man, you two are great students. <laughs> Look at that smile. <laughs> Look at that smile. Alrighty then. Now I'm officially enrolled, and I can now use his fighting style since I'm his own student. So your moves depend on your style. So becoming a, the student of legendary fighter grants you access to their style, which in turn you can use in battle. And each style includes moves specific to that legendary fighter. Seek out the legendary fighters and find the style that works for you. Unique attacks are normal moves that possess special properties. How many you have and what they do depends on which master style you're using. The unique attacks can be performed by, um, it's a command normal, essentially is what it is called, it's calling itself. It's a command normal and a target combo is what the unique attacks are. But if you'd rather not worry about doing them accidentally, you can always just remove them from your move list altogether. So keep that in mind when, that you're, they're all usable by, the, by default. Um, so I can move it. I can remove it anytime I want. I didn't read. I didn't read that through. Yes, huh. man. You know what? You make a darn good team. I think so. I don't think it'd be the worst thing for you two to take on the world together. We're gonna try to go the the Ryu and Ken route, are we? Well, they go. They went by themselves, actually. Absolutely. Do some training like we did at the gym and around Metro City. Yeah. Then, the two of you can go and travel the world. You can really get to know each other. And take on all comers. Seriously. <laughs> My goofy you'll have ass a blast. smile. Yeah, I'm sorry. It. I can't. I, I need to be strong, and I need to be it now. I'm not like you. I can't go around treating this like a game. Mm. Bosh, come on, coach. I'm done with the course. I got things I need to take care of. But you're right. This did give me some confidence. Thank you. Our only fight It's highlighted in It's bolded in freaking white. Later. Yeah, man. Yeah, I think I'm going to finish it with, with just through the tutorial. All right. Yeah. So let's let's wrap this up, shall we? So it seemed like something was nagging at Bosch, but chasing after strength in a mad rush is a recipe for disaster. Let's just hope he doesn't stumble down any weird rabbit holes. Yeah, I guess so. Uh. You know, to be honest, I don't consider myself much of a teacher. Press said I was too much of a hothead, had me teach new students to help chill me out a bit. How can I put this? So I'm giving it the old college try. But maybe my methods could use a little Moving work. Moving on. Anyway, that does it for today's lesson. I'll contact you using this sucker moving forward. Ah, right. Oh, and that's right. If you see Alice, tell her I said thanks for helping me out with the lesson plan. All yeah? right. She's got a ton to teach you, so I hope you two don't beat each other up too much. Okay. No problem. So now we can fight using classic controllers which is what I'm gonna be mostly doing because I don't I don't use it so I obtained rising uppercut so you got your masters actions you can use 
a shit ton it looks like. God dang, four slots for the master action? I didn't realize this either. Like I was kind of rushing it when I was playing through all this. And then you got your your L1 is your um your shortcuts to go through all this. And then you can go to your settings right here and um choose which other choose which um shortcuts you want to put, which is awesome. Some messages. So um Ah, okay. All right, so I think that'll I will just about leave it for here. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys happen to enjoy this first parter, there might not be as much edit as I will be doing here, but um, towards the next few videos, uh, it'll be a little bit longer, considering I have to actually fight people to grind and whatever, but that's besides the point so thank you guys so much for watching if you guys enjoyed this video be sure to like subscribe tap the bell notification and smash it if you think that's not enough and you'll be notified on upcoming streams videos vods alike that i will be doing in the future and i will definitely be returning to street fighter 6 this is world tour mode with our good old oc ron howard but you know what? Let's 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 take a picture here. Let's take ourselves a selfie of the big city. We're gonna we're gonna go ahead and take our God, I look so fucking goofy, good god. Alright, so this is your boy Lobo and Ron as soon as I can find the expressions on my faces because I can't apparently I can't <laughs> This is your boy Lobo and Ron howling out of Metro City. Peace.